So do you guys ever get frustrated telling your kids to wipe the counter and the counter gets cleaned but the floor doesn't? You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> do you guys ever get frustrated um, just being able to tell your kids like, hey, see that broom? Like sweep up the floor, right? And they sweep and you saw them sweep but when you walk on the floor you don't think they swept and you doubt if you even saw them sweeping because there's no difference. You guys know what I'm talking about? If you guys know what I'm talking about, then stick with me. I'm gonna tell you two awesome tips for both of these things that make it fun to learn. Kids love it, so let's jump in. Okay guys, before we get started, if you don't mind, just click on the subscribe button below. I would love to build that subscriber base and I would love to have you along for this journey of when I bring you stuff like this, like parenting tips, and things that just help you to live a motivated life, to live happy and to be inspired. All right, now let's jump in. So this is the, this is the most simple trick you guys are just gonna crack <laughs> that you never knew it before. <laughs> so it's really, really simple. All you have to do is get a box of nerds and sprinkle it out across the counter, okay? And then what you do is because if a candy like nerds, like that's what I like to use, if nerds bounces on the floor, your kids are gonna hear it and they're gonna know that they wiped a nerd off of the counter. If they wipe the nerd and it falls off of the counter, then they know and they can see it, it's a bright color on the floor and they start to train themselves. So you can teach them easily to go back and forth over the counter with the washcloth, gathering all of the nerds, all of the candy in the same single swoop and then to wipe it into their hand or into the sink so that it all gets captured and none of it lands on the floor. It's such a simple trick, but it's kind of like they need to see it really clearly with something, you know, bold in color like a candy before it really clicks for them, before it makes sense. Okay, so that was tip number one. It's super easy it's, and, it's, and it's fun because um, maybe you shake some other nerds in their hand and let them eat it as the process goes on. Super fun. Um, the second tip about sweeping the floors, we also use nerds for this trick. And you do the same thing, you spread the nerds all over the floor. And this time you're gonna need some blue painter's tape. And you form a square over by the trash can. And you ask your child if they think that they can get all of the nerds all over the floor into the square that's by the trash can. And so now they have a goal of a place where all of the dirt should go. At first, for training, when you use the nerds, it makes it very simple to be able to see what in the heck you know, they're doing and what the goal and the aim is. Then they eventually get all of it into the square and then they can scoop it up and put it in the dustpan and have it land in the trash. Hallelujah, hallelujah, right? It's so easy, it's such a great hack. It's a, such a simple, simple little thing to do with your kids, but then it cements it in their mind that like, hey, this is, this is how we wipe the counter and this is how we sweep the floor so that we actually gather and capture all of the items, all of the dirt that we're trying to um, clean up. So you guys, thanks for sticking around for the tip. Hopefully it helps. If you guys have any awesome tips for kitchen um, and helping kids navigate through the kitchen, um, then leave it in the comments below. I would love to know your fun ideas. Thanks for watching, guys.